Hello, I'm Brent Ferris from the Bearded Man Studios, and I completely forgot to explain that whole uh, list that we created in the camera operator on the passables, why we have floor here and all that. Um, and it's kind of important for me to explain it because if I don't, well then um, you may run into an infinite loop or something like that. So what it is, is basically um, if you look at the code, we have a list of passables, uh, which are strings, which we use down in the get destination function. Um, we go through passables and see if it's if we hit whatever we need to hit. So if uh, say I select this guy and I right click here, you see it went through that object, the raycast. The raycast hit that object and went through it. Now why is this important? Let's say that you have uh, let's build a little thing here. Let's say you have some geometry in your game. And the camera's on this side. Uh, let's say you have some geometry in your game that's this tower thing here. Let's duplicate that and stick it over here. Uh, stick it over here. There you go, that's the side of the camera. And now let's uh, duplicate it again and pop it up a couple times, rotate it 90 degrees, scale it out, and drop it in. Let's say you have something like this in your in your game. Uh, you're, you want to be able to move, and let's make it more practical on, let's say it was this fat, right? Um, in your game. So you have this big fat object in your game that is in the way of you clicking. Well if we don't have this passables and say what we're trying to hit, what this passables really is, it means it passes through everything that is not this. So as soon as it hits something named this, that's when it stops and says, hey, this is where I need to move to. And that is why we needed to name our plane floor. So now if I were to select this guy, and click right click right here it's gonna go through that and go and he's gonna go to the destination that I clicked on uh, at this angle so you can see that he's moving around I can't see him in my camera but you can see I'm able to click through this object uh, this would not be possible if um, we did otherwise uh, if we didn't do that floor thing and you'd often get through an infinite loop because you'd hit something that is uh, or you want to go through an infinite loop, but you'll hit something, and your object will try to go to wherever this is. It will try to go through it or whatever. Um, so that's why the passables is important, and that's why we say, hey, if the object that the raycast hit, if it is, if its name is not inside of the passables, well, let's just continue throwing the ray through, because um, because this is not the object we are trying to hit. We're trying to hit the floor. So you can see if I were to change it here, um, if I were to select the guy and then right click up here, nothing happens. The raycast is obviously hitting the object, but the uh, but he's not moving because uh, the raycast continues after it hits that object until it finds something inside of this passables object as a uh, destination hit object. So that's why we have that passables. It's highly important, and that's also why we had to name the floor floor. Uh, that's highly important because otherwise we wouldn't really be able to reach the floor. So uh, that's that. I uh, just wanted to clear that up for you. And uh, so, yeah, until next time.